Hello everyone! In contrast to most of my tutorial which are mainly technical and explaining how to use AI and robotics algorithms as well as how to install machine learning algorithms on local computers, in this video tutorial I will cover something completely different. Namely, I will bring attention and explain one issue related to NVIDIA GPUs. Since most of the viewers of my channel are interested in robotics and AI, you have probably heard that recently NVIDIA released a new chipset. That is, NVIDIA released a new GPU and it's GeForce RTX 5090. This is the fifth generation of these type of GPUs and over here you can see the Founders Edition. And if you look down at the specs, you will see that specs are really, really interesting and they are significantly better than the previous model 4090. You can see that almost everything is being updated. You have more memory, which is very important for AI and machine learning, and you can see the memory bandwidth is almost doubled. And if you click here, you can actually see the complete specs, you can see the base clock, you can see how the memory is being interfaced, etc. Now, this is an amazing GPU that I would like to use for machine learning and installation and running local large language models. Over here, you can see one very interesting graph. This graph compares the computer game performance of RTX 5090 and RTX 4090. The green rectangles represent the performance of RTX 5090, while these Light gray rectangles represent the performance of RTX 4090. And you can see that RTX 5090 has much better performance. And this is amazing. Although I'm not playing computer games, I believe that the similar performance improvement will appear and can be observed in the case of machine learning and AI algorithms. Another thing to observe is that the advertised price of this card is not too large. That is, for $2,000 you can get the new card and maybe you can buy two or three cards and then you can build your own machine learning server or a computer that can handle large language models. So that's not an issue. This should be an amazing card and you can probably use it for advanced machine learning. However, there is one big issue, and the issue appears when you try to buy this card. Now, let's try to illustrate this issue by trying to buy this card. Namely, let's go through the official website and let's click over here, and voila, you will be probably impressed. There are so many options for this card. So we can buy this version, this version, this version, etc. So let's click on one of these options, for example, over here. And of course, as always, there are two options in the United States of America. The first option is Micro Center and the second option is Newegg. For some reason, these links do not lead us to Micro Center on Newegg. However, that's not a problem. We can manually go to Micro Center website and to Newegg website. And if you go to Micro, Micro Center website and if you search over here, 5090, over here I selected in Cambridge, Massachusetts, and probably near you, you will see the same issue. And if you search for NVIDIA 5090, you hope, okay, I can purchase this card and you, can, you will see most likely this, sold out, sold out, sold out sold out sold out sold out so everything is being sold out there are no new cards and watch out this card is released on january 30th so it's only two or three days still you cannot buy it anywhere so let's try with new egg maybe we have more luck and let's see what happens out of stock 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 and you will see that all cards are out of stock. Okay, maybe we can buy the card on Amazon. So for example, let's search NVIDIA 5090 and let's see what happens. Of course, probably it's still not being advertised on Amazon and actually I could not find a version on Amazon. Maybe I should do something like this while I'm, when I'm searching. Let me try to see or maybe something like this. 
1990. However, I cannot find the card on Amazon. Okay, let's try to Google. So let's Google NVIDIA 5090 buy and you can see over here on the side, everything is out of stock, out of stock, out of stock, out of stock. And over here, you can see some news. And here's one thing which is very interesting. NVIDIA RTX 5090 eBay price soars to $9,000 as user revolt with frame photo. And you can see over here, demand overwhelming. So there is a huge demand for 5090. And if you go down the news, you will see that it's either out of stock or it's being sold for even $9,000 or something like that. Some people are even camping or sitting in front of Best Buy or Micro Center to buy. The if you go on eBay, you will see some people reselling this card. You can see for $3,000, for $5,000, for $5,500. For I don't think this is a legit, basically, website. For example, this seller, this seller, etc. So it looks like that scalpers are already doing their work. That is, someone purchased a car cheaply or had some connections to purchase it earlier and then reselling it for double the price or three times the price or something similar. You can see the price over here for $6,000, for example, which is insanity. To show you how history repeats itself and to indicate that this might be planned and that there is a pattern, I will show you only this post, namely, in February 2021, I created a post on my website saying we cannot buy graphics processing units anymore. And let me explain you a little bit about the background, since some of you were probably either very young or you don't remember what happened in February 2021. Namely, in February 2021, Bitcoin mining was a big thing and people were buying GPUs for Bitcoin mining. And you could not buy, for example, NVIDIA 3090. Finally, I was able to buy a computer with 3090. However, I had to buy a complete computer and I'm still using that computer. And the computer works perfectly. Now, if you see this scenario and if you go forward, fast forward to January or actually to February 2025, that is four years after this date, you will see that history repeated itself. So again, you cannot buy GPU and instead of Bitcoin mining, now there is a frenzy with AI and with other things. So behind the scene, there is a probably always some thing that drives the market that is that creates the need to purchase gpus and nvidia to sell gpus as well as other manufacturers so if there is no bitcoin mining there might be ai maybe four years from now there might be something else we never know maybe quantum computing or something similar now there is also another issue namely if you search for nvidia 4090 you should expect that the price of nvidia 4090 has dropped however it's not it's still relatively high for example if you want to buy the card on amazon you will probably have to pay this price around four thousand dollars which is insane and over here there is a founder's edition however can you find it can you purchase it so let's see on Micro Center, let's search for NVIDIA 4090 and let's see what happens. Can we buy the card? Let's see the exact GPU. Next, click on graphics cards and then find over here 400 series. And here it is. You cannot find the card over here. Maybe on your local micro center, you will be able to find a card. However, I cannot find it over here. And probably the same thing applies to other marketplaces such as Newegg. Namely, if you search for NVIDIA 49 Newegg, you will find it. However, look at the price. The price is $4,000, $4,000, $4,000, $4,000. And you can see from where it's being shipped, which is really, really interesting now if you even narrow down the search and you can also 
search on in stock let's see sold by new egg let's see what happens you will see computers you will not see gpus the whole point of this video tutorial is to point out one big issues with gpu market the gpu market is currently crazy it's completely unregulated People and companies are probably buying tons of RTX 5090 GPUs as well as 4090 GPUs. They're creating shortages, the prices are going up, and people who, are, who need these GPUs, not for playing computer games, but for machine learning research, as well as for some other constructive tasks, are in problem. They cannot buy GPUs anymore. And this will probably be for the next year. I'm not very optimistic that things will change. And think about NVIDIA is one of the richest companies in the world. I think it's currently valued around three trillion dollars and they are still tolerating this thing. So NVIDIA, wake up. 